Hey everyone, today I'll show you how to configure and playback SD card recording on your D-Link camera. If you have not installed a camera yet, check out the link in the description box. I will be using an Android phone, however, if you're using an iPhone or an iPad, the steps will be similar. To begin, launch the My D-Link app. Now there are three steps when configuring SD card recording. Preparing the SD card, setting up an automation rule, and then playing back your recordings. Insert the micro SD card into the camera. Depending on the model of your camera, it may be located on the bottom, the back, or on the side. Please note that only FAT32 and NTFS file systems are supported. Now tap the menu icon on the top left. Now tap device settings. Tap on the camera you want to enable the SD card recording on. Tap on storage. Tap on SD card. And then tap on used percentage. It is suggested to format the SD card if installing for the first time. Tap on Format SD Card. Note formatting the SD card will erase all data on the SD card. Tap Proceed. Tap OK. Tap Recording Type. Depending on your camera model, you will have two options, event or continuous. Event will allow the camera to only record when something happens, such as motion or person detection. If you select continuous, the camera will record 24 seven, overriding old recordings when the card becomes full. In this example, I will select event recording. Tap the back arrow. Next, we will select the recording quality. I will leave this at default, standard option. Tap the back arrow on the top left. Tap the back arrow a few times to go back to the home screen. Now that we have told the camera where to record to, let's create an automation rule to tell the camera when to record. Tap on the menu icon on the top left. Tap on Automations. Tap Start. Now automations have two parts, an event and an action. The event is what triggers the camera, such as motion or person detection, and the action is what the camera does once the event is triggered. In this example, I want my camera to record to the SD card and send me a push notification when a person is detected. Tap on the camera you want to create the automation for. Tap on person detection or motion detection. Tap next on the top right. Now we will select the action. Tap on Notifications, then tap on Push Notification. Now tap on your camera. Tap on Video Recording SD Card. Now tap Next on the top right. Here you will see a summary of the automation you just created. You can see here when a camera detects motion, it will send a push notification and then record to the SD card of the camera. Tap save on the top right. Tap activate now. Tap OK. Tap the back arrow to go back to the home screen. To view your recordings, from the camera's live video, tap on the SD card icon. 
Here you will see all the recordings from today. To view previous days, tap on Today and select the date you want to view the event from. To view the recording, tap on the event. If you want to download the video clip to your phone or device, tap on the down arrow. The video will start to download and will be saved into your photo gallery or photo albums on your device. Thank you for watching. For more videos and other helpful resources on how to get the most out of your D-Link device, please visit support.dlink.ca or support.dlink.com.